Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody guys, uh, today we will take a look at the Japanese Yen, um, in general currently uh, also interesting setups right now are forming on the euro currency and an Australian dollar, but on Australian dollar we have discussed, uh, we have talked yesterday, so today you could see that uh, market really has shown retracement right to the predefined level that we have discussed yesterday on Australian dollar right now is the question whether the market will continue to move up right from this area, this area. Logically and following the market mechanics also by the uh, by looking on the gold market it's, it seems that not bad chance that this really will happen but it, it will be better to wait for some reversal pattern on the hourly chart on the 30 minute chart that could confirm the real upward reversal right from the support on the daily chart that we have uh, estimated yesterday on the euro currency guys market has reached our predefined support is 110 even 11050 but uh, currently with, we see two important moments on the euro currency first uh, is that uh, bearish pressure looks a bit stronger than we have suggested initially because uh, if you remember we, we we have discussed the possible reverse head and shoulders uh, sorry uh, direct head and shoulders patient that should trigger the downward retracement but uh, when the head and shoulders starts to form we haven't got the right shoulder so market has dropped directly right to the support area it tells that the pressure of the bears it seems a bit stronger and currently it's not the fact that uh, current confidence support on the daily time frame chart will hold the price uh, if market will break it it will be a really significant challenge um, and uh, it really could lead to the further drop on the euro currency right now uh, is, the, is the major question whether the bounce up will happen here uh, but no patterns have been formed yet around confidence support so we, we need to wait a bit more, maybe probably one to daily sessions before we'll get the answer on this question. Uh, so that's why today we will take a look at the Japanese Yen, mostly because the first part of our um, uh, weekly analysis ha have been, has been completed. So if you remember in the weekly research we have discussed the shape of the possible retracement, how market could show the retracement here. And we have uh, come to conclusion that uh, retracement could take the three different shapes. First shape could be just ABCD pattern. Second shape is the possible some kind of the double repo lookalike pattern. So some, if you want, you could call it some kind of the double bottom. And the third shape that market could take is the some kind of the bottom line. Uh, but uh, whatever retracement will happen, bottom line and then upward retracement. Uh, probably market is limited with the downward potential since uh, we said that hardly market will break these lows anytime soon in the current week probably also because it's strongly oversold and stand at the FIP support on the weekly chart and we already see that the second week in a row market stands inside range of the of the two weeks uh, of, the, of the previous week so uh, last week and this week is also inside sessions for weeks a week that were that was a uh, two weeks before. I mean this plunge down strong week was. Um, and the first setup for the possible ABCD market is ready for that. Now is the question whether it will be really formed. Take a look what we have. Um, on the 4 hour time frame chart this retracement should lead us to an area approximately to the 1540 area, 1550 area. So this is if market will form AB equals CD pattern if market will show the deeper extensions this consequently we could get some further upward uh, potential currently guys uh, action here doesn't suggest some strong reversal right now it's, it's a bit uh, very lazy gradual action and currently it's difficult to say uh, I do not see real signs of the thrust or something of that sort that market is ready to continue move higher so uh, I would suggest, to be honest, that uh, probably we still will, will get some drifting lower. 
Uh, but right now, anyway, market has completed the predefined setup, and now we should get the real confirmation either of starting move up or the failure of our initial setup, the possible ABCD, ABCD, and shift into the next setup, the second possible shape of the retracement that we will be watching for is the double bottom or something of that sort. So for that purpose, market need to fail here and drop lower. Uh, here is the background of this setup. On the hourly chart, recall what we have discussed. We said two days ago, so we have the ABCD pattern. This here, we also had the butterfly, the completion of this ABCD. But we said that market could drift slightly lower because we have the untouched 161E target. So market could try to reach because we see some fast accelerations here and here um, that suggest that possible downward action is still possible. And right now you can see that it really has been completed. So 161A target has been hit slightly below the 618 support. So this is a 1246. This market right now stands at uh, 12 even approximately or even 1156. So per this, in other words, this level has been broken. So uh, right now market has completed this 161A target and also has hit, as you can see, weekly period support one. So if market really could continue to move up, and it really has intention to show this, to form this ABCD pattern, it should start our prediction right from this area. Because all targets have been completed, it, it has no reasons, if market is really bullish, it has no reasons to continue move down right now, since it has no targets below at this level. Also, market stands at weekly pivot support one, and we know that the pivot support one should hold the bearish retracement inside the bull trend. If market will fail to hold here, it will mean that is not a retracement. This is short-term bear trend and it will continue. Finally, guys, and most important thing here, uh, we have the divergence here, bullish divergence, and guys, take a look, we have the three drive by pattern. So market has completed the, the final point, the destination point of this ABCD pattern by forming the three drive by one. So uh, it means that uh, from that standpoint, it's, it's set up absolutely perfect. Now is the question whether it will work or not. If it will work, this market will start move up. If it will fail, then we will turn to the some kind of the double ripple, double bottom scenario. So I bought the three drive buying. So take a look that this was first drive, second drive stands at 127 of the first extension. I will show you from this. It just stands as a single candle. It's the first drive, second stands at 127 of the first, third stands at 1618 of the first and 127 of the second. So this typical three drive pattern. It hasn't quite reached for a couple of pips probably this target, but this is mostly due to the existence of the weekly pivot support one. So it also takes the shape some kind of the wedge pattern or something of that sort. Now it turns to the breakout. Uh, and uh, this is accompanied as you can see by the divergence. So very classical situation. So what else we could desire what else we would like to demand for treating it as the short-term reversal? Passion has been formed, targets have been achieved, uh, support has been reached. So market just has no choice. Either the scenario will work, because it also shows the attempt to continue move higher, or if it will, it will fail. So if market will drop below these lows, it will mean that we will not get this ABCD passion, and we should be ready for either just downward continuation or to forming some kind of the double bottom here. Maybe we will treat it as the double ripple look like. We will discuss this later. But right now, let's watching for this scenario. So, personally, guys, I do not want to trade it on the long side of the market because sentiment is very strong on the, on the demand on the safe haven assets. And for me, is more interesting opportunities to take in the short when the market show will show this retracement. But if you would like to trade this long, you, you, you of course could do this, but you should understand clearly the risks that you are, you are taking. Stop should be placed somewhere below these lows. This is the failure point of this free drive patient. So, I strongly do not recommend you to take any long position here, but you, you could decide by yourself. Uh, it doesn't mean that this scenario will work. This just means in the probability. Uh, this is the question of the probability. Um, in the attractiveness of the long position currently in the current environment. Uh, so, 
that's our current view on the current oh sorry on the Japanese yen so let's see whether this first uh, setup the first shape of the retracement will uh, take place or not if it will not take place if market will drop this here significantly and drop below these lows we will return back with the discussion probable double repo look like patron here or maybe double bottom or something of that sort so let's see what we will get or maybe we will get uh, tomorrow something on the euro currency so in this case we will shift to the euro so let's see